So, tomorrow, Bella is getting spayed. Um, I put this off for far too long. She's going to be one years old. Um, because of COVID, I was, like, holding off on a lot of her appointments. Like, all her puppy shots and whatnot. Plus, because she's, like, the baby and she's a small chihuahua we have, like, the thought of her going into surgery is, like, just not good. I hate it. So, I've been really delaying this. But, <sighs> hi, Lil. Um, I want to put her in obedience class and then work our way up to agility. And what I'd like to do is get the spaying done out of the way, get her all healed up, and then we can start school. She's playing with Gracie right now. She likes to hide under the couch. So anyways, um, as I was saying, so she has to get spayed, I've been putting this off. Um, so in August I made the appointment and the soonest she could get in was September 16th. <clears throat> so I was like, alright, sign us up, we'll do it. And then later on that day when I was putting it in my agenda book, I realized that the next day, the 17th, is her birthday. And not only is it her birthday, but it is her first birthday. So. I kind of screwed that one over. So it is the night before her spay, and we are hanging out in the basement, playing, getting a little bit of energy out because she is not going to be able to do much of anything for like the next two weeks. <laughs> Question again. I don't know. I don't have a specific answer. It depends. Normally, it'd be a week, a one a week. Is he allowed to? Is that COVID safe? Mister. Is that COVID safe? Whippy. So, yes, it is COVID safe hmm. because it's takeaway. Of course. I am back home now. And I think Lily and I are going to play a little bit outside and we might practice some weaves because we've been struggling with that a little bit at agility class. And then I have a bunch of work that I need to get done before I go back to pick up Bella. Guess what? The doctor just called and they're all done with Bella. That's insane because we dropped her off at like 7.30 and it's only like 9.15 right now. She's done. We can go get her soon. All right. We just got here. Time to get Bella back. All right. We got her back. I don't know how long she's going to stay in this little sash thing I got, but we'll see. Otherwise, I got a nice big comfy bed over here for her. We're home! Are you so happy to see your little sister, Lil? Yeah! I went out and I got Bella. tired and you guys have lost your minds where yep you're the other one lily bear she she needs some chill time okay i know you just really want to smell her 
Yeah. Lily, you are such a good girl. I was not expecting this kind of behavior from you. I mean, I guess it's not great. She keeps growling at anybody who gets too close to the playpen, but that's so sweet. She's like a protective bigger sister. It's adorable. Good girl, Lil. Good girl. Yep, that's your sister. Kind of weird how you keep staring her, but... <laughs> Lily, you gonna be okay? She don't feel good. Alright, in other news, I stopped at Target on my way to go pick up Bella, and I bought this really cute onesie. So what people do is um, they put the dog in them so that they can't like look at their stitches. So far with all the dogs we've had spayed, we've never had to use the cone, but just in case we do have the cone, but then I was also gonna try this method too. So what you do is you unsnap the bottom and that's where you fish their head through. And I might have to cut a little bit at the neckline, although honestly this looks kind of big. I, it might still be a little bit big on her. I don't know. We'll see. Um, and then on the back, once it's on her, I'll see like where her tail is and I'll just cut like a little slit for her tail. And then Lily, you get to wear the cute little trousers that it comes with. Aren't you excited? She ain't even paying attention. Hey Lily, you gonna show off your new outfit? Wow, that's adorable. I need to shop in the human baby section more often. <gasps> look who's got the outfit on. You look so cute. Yes. You look like you're ready to go to school. Mm-hmm. Let's go get your backpack. Let's go to school. <laughs> Let's get better footage. <gasps> wow. Look at Gracie in her new pretty dress. She's so excited. Wow. It is the next day. She has gone potty, she had her pain pill, so I just put the onesie on her. We're gonna try it out for a little bit and see how it goes. That is a size newborn onesie for her. She is a five pound chihuahua, so depending on your puppy size, you might need to go up in the onesie. Bella's feeling so much better. Such a big difference from yesterday. So yeah, we're just gonna take it easy the rest of the day. I probably won't have her in that onesie all day, but just for a little bit. And I do have a sick present for her. It's a little toy I got from Target, so I'll probably give that to her maybe later today or tomorrow when she's more with it, but she's already made a lot of improvement. And let's not forget, today is actually her birthday. We're just going to celebrate really good another day when I can like take her out for a walk or go shopping with her or something. I will keep you guys updated in future videos on how Bella's doing. But otherwise, that is it for today. So I'll see you guys in the next video.